Welcome back. In this video, what we're going to do is we're going to look at the isText function. The purpose of the isText function is to test in a cell to see whether the value that is stored in the cell is in fact text. Now, the function will actually return two values, true or false. So if the value in the cell is in fact text, it will return true. If the value in the cell is not text, it might be a date, it might be a number, something like that, it will return the response of false. So in our little spreadsheet up here, you can see I've extracted some information. This is sort of something you might get from a web address, website, or maybe a database, etc. So you can see we've got first name, then we've got Jason, 45, Mark, Matthew, Hans, Joseph. Oh, hold on, that's not likely to be text, is it? So what, we, what this allows us to do is to test our range of values. So in this first case, we're just going to type in is text, sorry, equals is text, round brackets, and then type the value of B4. If we hit enter, you can see it returns the true value. So what that's saying is in the cell of B4, that value is in fact text. Now, because I've used a relative reference here in our cell address, B4, I can drag this down and it says false, true, 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 true. So what this is saying here is the cell B6 contains text. The cell B7 contains text. But in the case here, B5 is in fact a number. So it's saying that it's not text, so therefore it's got to be false. So how can we resolve this if we wanted a number to act like text? Well, it's actually quite simple. All we do is go up into the entry area, type in a single quote in front of the number and hit enter. And you'll now see that it is actually treating that cell or the value of 45 as being text. So anytime you want a number to be treated as text, simply put a single quote in front of it. And that's all there is to it. So if you like this video, please hit the subscribe button or hit the like button and just let us know that you enjoyed the video in the comments field. Talk to you soon.